Hello everyone, uh, here I'm Jelly and today we're gonna continue the power and revolutions with Georgia. Uh, in the last episode, uh, uh, we didn't saw yet, uh, we free uh, the South Ossetia and made uh, the coalition with, uh, with uh, uh, another opposition party and today we are gonna try uh, to make the Georgia great again. So, well, first of all, we can check uh, what do we have here in the police budget and uh, what kind of um, changes we need to do for the future. But the main problem what we have right now is our budget. Uh, that our budget is in deficit and it's already uh, minus 3.42% uh, of our total uh, revenues. Uh, so uh, we need to think and find out the solutions what we can to do here to improve our budget. And the main thing actually is uh, that we can try to improve our industry uh, and I thought that it will be a good solution uh, to take a small uh, debt from uh, the outside banks and uh, to make like an investment uh, from this law uh, into the industry so um, we will check uh, possibilities uh, to international monetary fund uh, to take a law and uh, let's say it will be 1 billion why not uh, maybe let's publicity support organization it can uh, help uh, for the EMF uh, Director General uh, to agree with my uh, suggestion. What we see here, uh, what's happened? Why our budget started to be in excess? I guess that, yeah, uh, I guess that the game already calculated uh, that uh, uh, the director of uh, International Monetary Fund agreed to, take, to give uh, us a credit uh, for the 1 billion and uh, we'll have additional money, I guess. So, um, uh, to choose uh, for which sector uh, we can invest, uh, I guess, but first of all we need to see uh, what our the main uh, productions uh, per percent are of national sales. Uh, so, uh, like we saw uh, in the last episode, the tourist and hotel trade is our like a main sector uh, if uh, in our budget from where we are receiving the revenues and taxes as well. The hydraulic electricity is the second, Building, buildings, housings and roadway connections is the third, and chemical industry is in the fourth level. So uh, I guess that uh, do, a re do have a reason that uh, we found the possibilities to uh, make the contract with Sudan and purchase a cheap uh, oil from where uh, we can uh, to invest uh, additionally and subsidize uh, our fuel chemical industry uh, and uh, maybe somehow we'll try to increase the production of the sector and after that made, uh, make uh, bigger sales uh, for example, for United States of America, uh, because this country uh, purchases the chemicals into the largest price uh, in the world. 
what's hap what is happening here in uh, your brain. Oh. Actually, it's interesting uh, when we are checking the war into a Ukraine, I'm seeing that uh, the Ukrainians uh, actually are trying to keep in their sides with Crimea. Uh, Yevpatoria city and uh, Sifferopol so the best wishes for them but uh, here uh, all of us Donbass are under the Russia control so I guess that this war will gonna happen a few years in ahead and maybe for the short future uh, we will send the support uh, to Ukraine in ammunition we will try to support them and uh, why not uh, why we can't met with Turkey and suggest for them to increase uh, the sanctions for Russia as well because with Turkey is uh, our great uh, and good friends um, so we, I guess that it is a possibility to influence firms to do to do that. Okay, but uh, let's return to the industry, uh, to the chemical uh, sector, and um, yeah, we see that this sector is uh, producing 3.12 percent of our GDP, um, and the quantity is a little bit lower than it was in year 22 uh, the production in worldwide is 0 0.019 but uh, uh, it's a little bit bigger when it was in year 22 and our co consumption is 0 0.002 so that means that there are the possibility uh, to make the sales uh, to other countries uh, to increase our uh, uh, exports and the profits we are reach reaching are uh, 307 millions and the income tax uh, from these uh, uh, profits are 3.73 percent uh, so I guess that uh, this sector is a uh, good for the investments so we can try to subside them uh, let's try first of all with uh, 100 millions and check how our budget will uh, react <laughs> it reacts strongly actually it declines per, per 0.40 percent to our subside <clears throat> but uh, we will check, uh, I will speed up a little bit and we will check how our production is increasing and we will try uh, to make um, a contract with our another countries uh, the Prime Minister from Bosnia and Herzegovina when he meet with us, why not? International Yeah we reach at the lawn. <clears throat> and maybe for the future we will try to uh, take a loan from World Bank because the current rate is just uh, 0. Uh, five percent and uh, it's quite cheap uh, if we want uh, to the reach uh, to reach agreed goals uh, a little bit faster we need to take a loans because it is impossible to make something in cost of other loans here because our budget is our quite small uh, okay let's um, check the possibilities um, to make a contract with the United States uh, in chemical industry <clears throat> so as we see uh, 
uh, here it is possible to sell uh, 241 uh, ton uh, for United States because our consumption is just uh, 25 tons uh, and the price the average purchase price is uh, more than uh, two times bigger than uh, average sale price in Georgia is so uh, I will offer them a quite expensive price and uh, we will check uh, the possibilities uh, how we do we react in that price and as you see uh, from this contract we, we will gonna earn approximately 1 billion uh, and uh, the number of years will be 5 so in total approximately 5 billions per 5 years let's try we have strong suspicions that this organization is preparing to carry out an attack in the next few hours uh, okay I guess that we have a small problem here uh, our secret service uh, agent uh, our secret uh, agent uh, general noted us that uh, uh, one of terrorist organization uh, will try to make a terrorist attack but also we receive it, uh, the feedback from the United States uh, regarding the chemical industries uh, uh, purchasing agreement and we want to decline the price but um, we will offer them a little bit lower price than it was before and we'll check how do we reacting and it's time to check uh, actually uh, what do we found hmm. interesting because Interesting because um, nothing suspicious I can see here, but we can try to proceed with an arrest. And um, um, yeah, you found nothing happened. Nothing happened here. So false alarm, I guess. Let's check how our chemical industry is right now yeah as you see uh, the GDP of activity in, this, uh, in the country uh, in year 23 was increased and our budget is already an increase uh, because uh, the production worldwide uh, was increased until uh, 0 0.020 from 0 0.019 and it is uh, only per few days I guess that means that uh, this industry, industry sector uh, will take uh, more employees uh, because our unemployment right now is 18% uh, and we will increase the production take more employees our unemployment will dec decline inflation will decline also uh, and our budget will increase so it is like a um, big circle in economy what is very important to understand why we are doing that and it uh, looks that uh, everything is going in the right way from that point And we received the feedback from uh, the United States and we again trying to decline the price and from my practice actually um, what I know about these agreements that not more than two times you can decline or increase the price the third time uh, the opponent uh, just uh, cancel the contract and without any uh, compromises so I guess that I will agree with that price it's a little bit less than I expected uh, we will not reach uh, 1 billion but let's say that it's okay 
and let's agree on that and uh, we will be able to check uh, our fan fi uh, budget and in finances uh, how it's increased after a few days I guess the recalculation will be done because uh, absolutely uh, the taxes we will reach from this contract uh, will increase our economy it is 100% but also if we are talking about uh, geopolitical uh, uh, situation here it is very important to know that uh, we have a border with the Russia and near the us uh, uh, in the last episode, uh, we didn't watch actually, can find uh, a link in the comment into the description. Uh, we have here uh, six or seven uh, airports, uh, air bases, uh, and it's very important to have for us a clear uh, air defense system because uh, if in the near, if in the future, we will uh, be attacked by the Russia. Uh, our weakest uh, point will be air defense. We don't have right now anything, and uh, the main uh, the main artillery from where we will gonna attack us will be from the uh, air bases. So for the future, if we want to invest uh, into our defense, definitely we need to invest it into the air defense so um, that's what I'm talking about uh, when I'm talking about the budget <clears throat> why it is so important to increase them because if we want to increase into these sectors like uh, defense, like employment like uh, children uh, into the education we need to hardly work on that and uh, And um, actually, uh, as you see, uh, these things working because our inflation is decreasing as well. Uh, per half of a year, uh, the inflation decreased at approximately 1%. That's a good figure. Uh, we didn't change that to key interest rate because uh, right now we have uh, 9.5. That means that uh, this interest rate won't, interest rate won't let uh, uh, to the property owners or in property investors to invest into the new properties because uh, uh, the law uh, we will take from the bank uh, will be uh, approximately 9.5 percent higher. Uh, do have a do have this uh, decision so uh, I won't increase that more uh, for the future maybe next year uh, I will decline them but right now while inflation is so high I need to keep it without any changes here and uh, <clears throat> actually a uh, very good figure here to see also uh, that um, our uh, that our uh, currency uh, right now is approximately 3, per, uh, three cents uh, uh, expensive if we are differencing between euros and one cent expen more expensive if we are differencing between dollar so uh, that means that the purchasing power of uh, our uh, currency is increasing so it's also a good signal that means that the decision uh, we done before is going well.
and let's check um, our tax system uh, in the last episode we tried uh, to increase the wealth tax and uh, like uh, the wealth tax is supporting our uh, public safety uh, this decision was uh, not taken by the parliament uh, but uh, like we talked before we were gonna try to make uh, like a reform and with the reform uh, to try uh, to increase the wealth tax and uh, decrease and other things uh, to reach the balance in the parliament uh, to give a support for them uh, to approve this law and um, I think that 2% 2.4% uh, it's quite high to increase and reach uh, an approval into the parliament so at first we will try to increase from 0.5% and we are going against let's try to meet them Because uh, who watched the first episode, uh, we uh, will know that uh, for the leaders of uh, these parties, actually we give a bribe uh, $100 and they are under our wings. So I guess that it is possible to push them uh, to change the decision to the parliament. Let's check. And let's find out. Let's meet with um, the Conservative Liberal Party president, let's sure. have coffee, champagne, and uh, encourage him to support this law. You're taking advantage of the situation. Well, I really don't have a choice. I'll see what I can do. As we see, uh, the push was, uh, went very well uh, because uh, the Zina uh, agreed uh, uh, to change the situation into the parliament and support uh, our law. Now we will uh, wait uh, the next party president. Coffee, champagne, she's charming, yes. and encourage. You're taking advantage of the situation. Well, I don't really have a choice. She agreed as well. She agreed as well, and we will wait for one day, I guess, and sh it should be enough to check uh, do the situation was... Yep. As we see, uh, this law will be passed into the parliament because right now for, for uh, the parliament is for uh, 51 percent and uh, the Democratic Republic League uh, is totally for uh, the conservative liberal party is against but in total we have for uh, about if we are talking about this law and that's good that means that we will reach um, a little bit more in our budget, we will increase them, and we will be able to invest for the future. Let's check how our uh, chemical industry is going. <laughs> As you see, right now it's already 6%. Uh, in our GDP uh, was 3% and we are producing 0.039% uh, uh, in global share uh, instead 0.017 so we are able to sell more to sell more um, for the countries and let's check um, can offer the best price. Actually, I didn't check it. Uh, do the United States? Uh... Actually, I uh, before I didn't check. Uh, do the United States uh, 
uh, purchasing in the high highest price so right now maybe I will check uh, okay purchase ah, yeah United States uh, purchasing the highest price here but we can offer the Taiwan as well uh, let's offer to them <clears throat> Taiwan is here Greetings to Taiwan, or Taiwani should I say actually, sorry for my pronouns. Chemical industry. And you remember that uh, uh, before uh, we sold everything we are producing uh, in difference between consumption, right now uh, we are producing approximately 100 tons more and we invest invested only 100 millions and we are reaching uh, these reinvestments for taxes so it's a totally good decision what we take it before and um, I believe that uh, our budget will be greased And the bill has been the pass was taken into Parliament. Okay, what more we have here? These carbon taxes actually it's a good tax uh, if you want to go green act no it is the main thing and you can reach from here uh, quite a big amount of money if you have a big industries but uh, it is declining uh, the production and the efficiency of them and in long term uh, these taxes are going well, but in short term, it, it become broken totally the industry. So it need be it should we need to be very careful when uh, we are proving this tax. I will try to make a new reform and name it like um, tax reform. And um, other new taxes tobacco, um, vehicle registration, let's say fifty euros per car, odd reform. Let's say the forestation tax, tax reform, and let's say. tax reform as well and we need to add something more more popular for parliament let's check how a position will be and confirm Let's add 
50% of plastic. <laughs> yeah, I can't What about the gambling? 50% opposition or and tax reform <laughs> against ration and exoneration and parliament position before and put them into a tax reform and check we are against them. Why? And let's try to reduce per one percent. On tax reform and but reform of we didn't agree reform you have just cancelled the reform that was under deliberation don't worry the voting process hadn't started yet, so the cancellation is official. My fault. Mm. Maybe I tried to sell more than we need. Chemical industry. <clears throat> Ah, we are producing more than consumption have, so that was my fault. Let's try to sell to America as well, again, our chemicals, yes, and offer them a high price. Check what do we are offering to us. That's offered. This. Okay, let's agree on small quantity, but um, a better price here. And I want to check the tourists group. Let's put them under the surveillance. Violence and under surveillance. The bill has been okay. Position. Hmm. 
interesting. Criminal responsibility. Only 14 years? Criminal responsibility only 14 years? Let's try to increase them to 15. Oh. No one agree on that. Interesting why. <laughs> I guess what our uh coalition broken despite our sweet promises we can see that the common program which everybody agreed to had not been implemented despite all the extra time granted uh, suicide is to say that uh, we consider the betray in order to serve your own political interests after one final meeting of our national office we will leaving the coalition uh-huh so we lose the coalition and uh, we have quite interesting situation right now into the country uh, we don't have a government Let's review us a little bit. Accept and accept. <laughs> I guess what uh, we will try to work right now without coalition because um, honestly I don't understand um, what means uh, for me like a player uh, in good way uh, to have a coalition because um, I can implement uh, each players I mean uh, it doesn't matter do them uh, in um, political parties, conservative liberal or uh, another, I can talk with all political parties' presidents and uh, offer the bribes and encourage them to support the laws. So um, honestly, I don't uh, see the point why it should, um, why should I need to make a coalition here. So um, I don't know. Not right now, maybe. <laughs> also strange that uh, our conservative liberal party don't want to encourage referendums. I can't agree on that. Uh, I will invite Benodia uh, to talk with me and encourage them to change their mind. But uh, we need to change our cabinet. Sometimes advisor offer uh, to create the sure. cabinet. Okay, glass, champagne. Authorize use of randoms on national. There was a time when I owed you something, definitely. But that's ancient history now. Today, I feel I've made enough sacrifices for your pleasure. Uh huh. There was a time when I. 
No problem. You're a deadpan as always. Our inflation is growing mm, because our country is growing 11%. Um, actually, I'm waiting why, uh, while the advisor. Perspective analysis. Uh, offer to us uh, to do uh, the cabinet uh, instead of me because it's quite long and uh, very boring uh, thing to create the cabinet. And I will try to work with them in a few days. Maybe the adv advisor will offer to us something. But I'm worried about this terrorist territory, but honestly, because I see. Uh, that the move movements are going here, that um, rebel camps are created. The bill has been voted on. But unfortunately, the bill has not been passed. Maybe we should make an invasion here. I don't have such money right now. We have in reserve five million, five hundred millions. And what if we will connect to Belize and Kutaisi? with uh, high-speed railway because uh, it also should help to increase the economy no responsible Let's try to create a government.
okay we created the government it's quite a long term uh, to create them uh, but we can continue with our goals and uh, yeah i'm quite interesting to see um, how much it will cost uh, if uh, we will try to connect Gori and Daisy. Oh, it's too expensive. <laughs> totally too expensive. I thought that 500 million is quite uh, big money, but seems that not. And um, if we if we will do if we will do the port interesting how it will improve the economy it's hard to say actually because uh, there are no calculations uh, what reinvestments we will reach uh, after we port building because it's quite expensive in total it cost uh, five billions uh, four billions and two hundred millions uh, but we have five hundred million uh, five hundred um, five hundred millions in our uh, in our uh, treasury reserve but um, I didn't thought that uh, it's so expensive actually so we need to wait we need to wait for the future work like we are working right now Our chemical industry is growing uh, more than uh, two times. If we are differencing uh, between uh, 2022, uh, and the profits are increased, the sales was increased, productivity decreased. Actually, I didn't understand this uh, productivity index. Uh, if there are someone uh, who can explain how correctly and clearly uh, this index is working, uh, leave uh, in the comment section. The employment uh, also is 0 0.252 uh, 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 per all country in tourist sector. The National Association of Alternative uh, world president encourage us to be more organic but not right now can increase a little bit here. We have a news. Huh. It's begun. World leaders are beginning to arrive at the United Nations Framework Convention of Climate Change. Okay. And uh, what objectives we have that till year 2030 we will decrease uh, to 19 uh, megatons of CO2 and to be uh, carbon neutrality uh, our goal is 2050 I don't believe actually that uh, till year 2030 we will be in 19 megatons of CO because right now our CO is only 10, so it's possible totally. Okay, confirm. Confirm. 
white boots. The bill has been voted on, but it's... We disagreed on referendums. The terrorist organization has nodded off. This is the least you can say. And since we're doing nothing to wake them, this... Well, actually, uh, our chief of army is right. Uh, we do nothing here, and um, we can improve our army. Let's infiltrate. We have two thousand, uh, three thousand six hundred fighters. Uh, uh, 1,700 mercenaries, 35 tanks, <laughs> it's more than my army have at all, I guess. How many tanks we have? Only 53. And 59 missile launchers. So... We need to do something here. And uh, I guess that into the next episode, it will be the thing, what goals we will try to do here. So I guess that for today it's enough. Uh, here was I, I'm Jelly, and uh, thank you for watching. Uh, watch uh, my next episodes with Georgia we will try to free the Abkhazia region uh, please subscribe like leave the comments in the comment section with the questions and with uh, the explanations uh, with the questions I asked before uh, thank you and see you till tomorrow